Hey, Ag Teacher Thoughts here, coming at you with another video. We are wrapping up another run off of our ethanol production uh, project. So we just finished one, which was a sugar solution, and with our brand new yeast. So we did a lot of uh, research and found out we were using the wrong yeast and we should do something a little bit different, and we tried a new run. And today we are checking out and seeing what we got. So I'm gonna turn this video around here. And on here, we are looking at our, our proof. Let's see if we can get that. Look at that. That is 90, is that 94? 94 proof there? Yeah. It's, it's and then according to the chart, it's around 88%. 88% if we adjust for temperature. So we have to adjust for temperature when it comes to uh, density of this. So we are about 88 proof. So there's going to be a little bit of work that we're going to need to do to get this uh, ethanol to the point where we can run an engine with it. And then at this point, we're also measuring our output to figure out how much ethanol we've got from our, um, from our run. So we started with 19 liters of uh, solution. And there is... Let's see, what is that? Is that two, two liters there? So here's two liters. And then all the way down here, spin that around. 200, it's about 2200. 22, let's see if we can get this in here where we can focus it. It's clear, so it's gonna be tough to see. Let's try that again, focus. So our ethanol is right there. So it's about 2200 milliliters or 2.2 liters of ethanol. So we started with 19 uh, liters. So we're getting, well, it's just about a little bit more than 10%, about 12 or something. Uh, 10, 12% uh, uh, ethanol. ethanol back off of our run. Sorry, I'm trying to think and talk at the same time. Uh, no script, not planning this. So that becomes a little bit of an issue. But that is our, our other run of uh, ethanol for our production. Uh, and then of course, now that we know uh, how much ethanol we have, we can go ahead and go through our denaturing process. So we've got to uh, mix our ethanol with our denaturing product at the uh, percentage uh, that we have in our plan. So we're gonna be doing that off camera uh, but yes, this will all be denatured and uh, combined with methanol, and it will be toxic when we're done. So there's no drinking this. This is all now lab-grade uh, alcohol. Uh, so this is the full run right there all in one container. And that is pretty exciting. And I'll take you over here and show you some of the other equipment that we had this time. Uh, so we had... Uh, a uh, a stirrer that we were using to be able to uh, mix our material up. Uh, we have our large uh, uh, hot plate here with also a magnetic stirrer. So this one, the stirrer is on the bottom. Uh, this one, the stirrer goes in the top. So if we have, you can see that blade there. If we have a material that's a little bit thicker and it's kind of hard for that magnetic stir bar to get going, we'll use the stirrer for the top. And then back here again is our whole uh, distillation uh, column so our chiller and our still there's the column right there so anyway this project is this project is uh, continuing on um, and we're at the change of a semester so I think our plan coming up is we're going to use some molecular sieves to uh, put that in there and absorb a little bit more water get that proof a little bit higher uh, I think we're shooting for what, 99, 98, 99%. Uh, so, was that 196 to 198 proof? I think is how that calculates out. But yeah, hope that's interesting. And uh, maybe in a few weeks, uh, we do have a donor lawnmower engine. So we got to get all the gasoline run out of that one. Uh, at the new semester, I've got some students that are going to clean that up and get that going. And then uh, we'll get the molecular sieves in there and maybe in a few weeks we'll run that engine and we'll post a video about it. Uh, but this has been uh, ethanol production here at Kendrick High School. Uh, and again, yes, 
We are federally licensed uh, for the YouTube reviewers that are looking at this. We are licensed through the federal government uh, to do this as a research uh, project with our lab. If you have any questions, go ahead and drop them in uh, the comments and uh, hope you learned something. Ag Teacher Thoughts out.